So we're here, we're in Bahrain, and you're quickly going to see me uh, do, doing my setup here for what's going to be an interesting Grand Prix. Hello, I am Psycho Enigma, and I am in the Horrible Racing Team. Uh, it's the official name for, uh, for HRT. I've finally figured out that that's pretty much what it means, and... Uh, yeah, it's that that's officially not not my material. I I stole that joke from Mr. Freaky Fungus, but I find it funny and I thought I'd share it with you all. So we're going to the grid, and well, we're going to the grid now, should I say? Once once these wonderful gentlemen have got me off my jacks, can can you get me off Jack, please? I I, I think he needs some air. There we go. Yes, yes. Jack is alive. This this is good. As long as Jack is alive, that's that's all that matters. Okay. So we're here, we're on Bahrain, we're on the grid, and with this with this race going up, i am literally got Abu Dhabi to do, and then I've got the American Grand Prix. So, yeah, career races will be resuming next weekend with, with all, all good and hope. So, you can see Mr. Freaky Fungus in this Grand Prix. He is in a Ferrari, and we are going to be flying off the grid straight away. We're a bit late on the curves, and we've not actually got a fantastic getaway here. There's only seven people in this race, but we're going to have to look to, to get some spots on the line. Mr. Freaky Funk is breaking horribly early there, and we're going to take a nice tight inside line. We're going to hopefully get on the gas. We've, we've got up to fourth. We are third. We've, we're on the curb, and, and we've got someone has decided to integrate with our left rear wheel, and we, we, we've dropped horribly down the field, down into fifth place, and... And, uh, and Freaky Fungus, what what the hell were you even doing all the way back there? It's just like you're, you're miles behind, turning into turn four, back end sliding. You know, we've got a bit of, a bit of dirt on our tyres. So we, ha we haven't had the best start to this race, and we've not got the best cornering ability here, but trying to keep the, the front wheel on. A guy's gone off just up the road ahead of us, and there's three of them. Three, there's, a, there's another guy gone right. What, what is this guy at this... 10,000 fists, and it, it says F1 in his name, that's quite smart, in his Toro Rosso doing, I'm on side behind him, and I've gone deep into that, that, that corner that's really difficult, I can't remember to think of the name of it right now, flying towards the fast switch backing curves, they're two abreast, they're fighting, they're brawling it out for third position, my teammate in the other HRT has fallen behind me, he's been become my prey for the next couple of corners, so he's gone to defend, we'll, dart down the outside and we've once again got it horribly wrong on the outside but we'll tuck up behind him we're gonna just, just sit in his slipstream here he's German it's Puma Krez 70 that that must mean something to do with Pumas in German and he's just he's completely forgotten to turn in D there is a corner there you, you're meant to turn when there's a corner so We've taken fourth position with you know, we're lap one of three complete. We're flying down the main straight. We're 180, 181, two, three, four, 185, 186 miles an hour, 187 before we slam on the brakes for turn one. And we've been absolutely demolished by our teammate who decided that he di he didn't want us to turn in to the first corner, much like he didn't turn into the other one. But he's gone completely off the track and he's fallen completely out of contention. And it's just all gone wrong. So I'm I'm the only one here to represent. The only one here. To try and get a place, and Doc Inu, who was running third, what the hell was he trying here? We're gonna go try and round his outside. We're gonna keep the inside line, push him out wide. We've pushed him wide, and he's gonna come. He's come absolutely flying down our inside line. He's put us off. He's spun. We spun the pair of us. Here comes Freaky Fungus, looking to pick up some of the, some of the scraps. So it's going to be an all-out brawl. This Dokunu guy doesn't appear to know what it means. The rules of, you know, allowing someone to get past or at least giving someone room. He's just, he's one of those guys that will absolutely just ram you off the road if need be to try and defend a podium. So we are going to have to be very tactical here and try and find a way around his outside or his inside or his over the top or underneath. We'll dig a hole and drive underneath him if need be because this guy is not willing to let us pass. And that 10,000 fist has just stormed off into the distance due to this guy causing me to spin. He's gone off wide. We've got a load of speed. We're going to go drive past him. And look at that. There's horrible driving. That's not even defending. That's just brute force. Just trying to get his elbows out to defend. He can't take the final corner. He's gone deep. We've got a much better run. We've got a much better run. We've got too much downforce on. He's a bit quicker away. So we're going to have to sit in his slipstream, use up the remainder of our curves as JSHD sets the fastest lap of the race by some three odd seconds. And we're going to go for our vengeance. We're going down the outside, pushing him on the inside, and that's just worked out horribly badly for us. Tried to squeeze him to the apex, and it hasn't worked out, and we've dropped back behind Freaky Fungus. We're down into fifth, 
and he and and ten thousand fists. No, Dokinu, Do that that one, that Toro Rosso was just gained monumentally. And Karma, Karma is a bitch, my dear friend, as you have just slid out wide. And it's down to me versus Freaky Fungus on the final lap. It's a Ferrari versus a HRT. I've completely forgotten how to drive an F1 car. But this guy will not give in. He's, he's gone flying down my inside trying to take me out. And he's missed horribly. His, his accuracy's got worse. And here we go. We're halfway through the middle sector. Freaky Fungus versus Psycho Enigma. It's the greatest modern F1 battle in the modern era. We're going to get the better acceleration. We're going to try and drive straight past him. He's hooked on us. He's got our right wheel. We're trying to take the racing line. There's the Ferrari right there. And in the end, I have to yield. I'll defend my inside line. And I've been squeezed. And, and then Freaky Fungus has gone out wide. And we've taken third position. We've somehow ended up on the podium. Can we look to defend it? We just need to take these next few corners nice and, and, and simply. And we've not got that one very well. We've, we've kind of gone over and used the curb. Freaky Fungus has got some company back there in a Dolkino. And 10,000 fists. As you've got, look at look at the way he's just accelerated. We would have been able to hang with him if it weren't for the Toro Rosso. And someone just hasn't bothered breaking. And he's, he's gone flying off and, and smashed into the barrier. And, and, and he's lost connection because he couldn't take him out. It's just, it's just so unfair. So we remain on the podium. Sure, we weren't that quick on speed. But there, there was doc, Dokinu doc, doc, with him. It's just not been fair to us at all, just taking everyone out when it wasn't absolutely necessary. Somehow we managed to fight back into third position, but it was a it was an interesting Bahrain Grand Prix. You see a lot of tracks on repeat here, so hopefully for the next one I've got a bit more, a bit of variety in my track. So I'll see you all when the next video is uploaded.